So um, today we, be, we will be going to do USR mass decimal operation of a fraction exercise part 3. Okay, previous part we already do question number 7. Okay, now we are going to do question number 8. The diagram below shows the length of a piece of wood. A mirror cut the wood into 8 pieces. What is the length in meter each piece of the wood? Okay, so let's try to do this question. Okay, Amiro cut the wood into eight pieces of equal length. What is the length in meter of each piece of wood? So we just need to divide eight. So this one we can see here one one over five. We need it to divide it to eight part. Okay, so one one over five divided by so how to do this so basically i uh, make it to the improper fashion 5 times 1 5 i get 6 over 5 6 over 5 divided by 8 i just put 8 over 1 can or not because 8 divided by 1 you still get 8 so then 6 over 5 divide become times 1 over 8 okay song sang kan okay after that um, let's do some shortcut here first because this one can divide this one can divide that let us divide first so this one i divide by 2 i get 4 this one divided by 2 i get 3 so 3 times 1 is 3 5 times 4 is 20 so the answer is 3 over, so the answer I just write here, the answer will be 3 over 20 what? Meter. Always remember to write the unit. Okay, if you don't write the unit, then you won't get the mark that you needed. If Amiro uses 5 pieces of the wood, find the total length in meter of the wood used by Amiro. Miss Amiro need to use 5. So, what is the length that is needed to use by Amiro? So, from this question, we know that um, Amiro uses 5 pieces of wood. Previously, we already find that uh, 3 over 20, correct? Or not? 3 over 20 for if you divided it by 8. So, what I need to do is 3 over 20 times with 8. So I divide it by uh I divide it by four I get two I divide it by four I get uh eh, I cannot divide it by four divided by two sorry divided by two I get four divided by two I get ten then divided by 2, I get 2. Divided by 2, I get 5. Okay, uh, sorry, yeah. 5 pizza, not times 8, uh, times 5. So this one I did it wrong already. Let's erase it and do again. I wonder if the answer is so weird. Hmm. Let's erase this one and uh, do again. So 3 over 20 times with 5 correct not? so this one divided by 5 I get 4 1 divided by 5 I get 4 3 times 1 is 3 over 4 so the answer will be 3 over 4 meter okay this is the answer okay how many pieces of wood are needed to obtain the length of 9 over 10 meter this one you try to do how many pieces of wood are needed for 9 over 10? But before we know how many pieces are needed for to make this length, we need to know one pieces is how many. So we already do the question. 5 pieces is 3 over 4. 1 pieces. Each piece, each piece of wood is 3 over 20. So basically, uh I just need to use 9 over 10 divided by 
3 over 20, correct or not? Because this one is one piece. This one is say how many piece. So what I need to do is very easy. I just need to uh, just need to use 9 over 9 over wait, 9, nine wait, 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 something. 9, wait, ayo. 9 over 10 divided by what? Divided by each pieces of wood is 3 over 20. So divided by 3 over 20, very easy. Equivalent to 9 over 10. Song Sangkan, divide become times, down go up, up go down. Wait, 3 on it. Okay, then uh, cut, cut. Divided by 10, divided by 3, I get 3. Divided by 3, I get 1. 3 times 2 is 6. So the answer is 6 pieces of wood. 6 pieces of wood. So this is the answer. So easy. 6 pieces of wood. Let's move on. The diagram below shows three number cut. Okay, so 0 0.5, 18.6, and 8. P times Q divided by R. Hmm. Determine the cut PQR such that the answer of the arrangement has the largest value. So how you want to arrange so that it will get the largest value. Okay, so you need to get the largest cut. Okay, largest cut. Okay, if you want to get the largest number, correct not? He says he want the largest value, means the largest number. Usually what you need to do is, because you only have three number, so what I need to do is, I need to times the two biggest number, divide by the smallest number, correct or not? You want times the smallest number divided by a uh, big number, then you got the small value, correct or not? The bigger value that you times, the bigger number. And as for divide, you want to divide with the smaller one. If you divide big, then you get small. 10 ringgit divided by 10, you only get 1 ringgit. 10 ringgit divided by 1 ringgit, you get uh, 10 ringgit back, okay? And 10 ringgit divided by 50 cent. So by 0 0.5, for example, you will get 20 ringgit. So for P, I will take, since this is talking about the largest value, so for P, I want to take the largest value is 18.6. This one, 18.6. So this one, I just want to put it here. The, let's put it here. Because, why? Because P is the, this one is the largest. The second largest will be this one, I will put it here. And the smallest one will be this one, I want to put it at here. So there's nothing to do, just I want to arrange the big number and then divide with the smaller number. So that's the answer. Okay, for question B, the diagram below shows two rectangular PQRS and WX. Y, Z. Given the length of x, y is x, y is 3 times of o, r. Means when I read this question, I know that um, if o, r here, o, r here, so that is 3 o, r, correct or not? I just write here, okay. Um, o, r. I just write here um, the length of O R. Okay, where is the O R? Q R is it? Oh, this question error. Uh, Q R. So um, uh, just put an X here lah. So I just put here X got three X. Calculate the length of X Y. Okay. So what's the answer? So this is a three mark question. So did you try? And did you manage to get the answer? So, uh, for this one, firstly, we need to get the x, correct or not? We need to get the x. So, uh, 
this one times x will be get 264. So in order to get x, we need to use 26.4 divided by uh, 4.8. Okay, so let's do this one. So usually I will just do like this 20. 26.4 up to you lah because different student got different um, method of division so uh, usually I tend to do like this 4.8 move one side move one side 264 over 48 divided by 12 I will get 22 divided by 12 I will get 4 Divided by 2, I get 11. Divided by 2, I get 2. Divided by 2, I get 5.5. Divided by 2, I get 1. So this one, 5 point sign means x. So I will just need to use 5.5 times 3. So I get 5 times 3, 15. 15. 5 times 3, 15 plus 1, 16. 1 dot here, 1 dot here. So 16.5. So the answer will be 16.5. Just look back the unit. Okay, here is CM. Remember to write the unit. CM. Hula, you got the answer. Easy as ABC. Okay, let's move on to the next question. The table below show the consumption of petrol of intrigue to every car at certain speed. Okay, distance is 200 km, then you need to use 12.4 liter of petrol. The distance between Putrajaya and Moa is 180, which is lesser, so obviously this one will be a little bit lesser. Intrigue to Cliffy drive from the car to Moa at the same speed. Okay. How many liter of petrol does inject geography consume? Two marks. Okay, so you try to do this, see whether you can get the answer or not. So this question is only two marks, so it won't be that um, difficult, correct or not? So uh, if 200 meter is 12.4, so 180 kilometer is how many? So usually what I do is, I just write down, it's very easy, actually it's ratio, correct or not? Okay, nah, just let me fix this. Okay, so I just write here, 200, ratio is, if 200 is 12.4, then 180 is something lesser, I just put here x, because I need to find x is how many. So I just need to song sang kan. You just remember, okay, if 200 is 12.4, 180 means x. X is something that I don't know. So what I need to do is I need to times up. This one times here, this one times here. Okay, just remember that, okay? So I go down a little bit because not enough space. So 200 times x equals to 12.4 times 1. 8, 0. Okay, just remember like that. Okay, song sang kan. X is this one I bring back to here times when I bring over it become dy. So I just do 12.4 times 180 divided by 200. So uh, let's do dy, cut the 0, cut. Divided by 2, I get 10. Divided by 2, I get 9. So, um, after that, I, just, I think I just need to times it, right? To make it easy. So, 12.4 times 9, I will get uh, 36. 18, 19, 20, 21. 1 times 9, 9, 10, 11. 11. So, it will be 1, 1, 1. 1.6 over um over 10 equivalent to uh, move here one move here one so it will be one one point one six divided by one so the answer is eleven point sixteen so just right here the answer is one one point one six what's the unit the unit is at uh 
liter right here got liter or liter how many liter so I just write liter so here's the answer cut up so um, thank you very much I will see you at the next video